Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new video. In this video we're going to be playing some Mon Bazool, because it's been such a long time since I played this game. Um, controls. Why is the sensitivity so weird? Um, anyway. So basically the first thing we're talking about is I'm going to show you the new feature. Just look at this cool thing. It's literally like this portable game console. It's super duper cool. Um, there's even like a little game. Oh. I'm not really sure how it works, honestly. But it's super duper cool. Um, yeah. <laughs> and that's the battery at the top. Yeah, you have to charge it a lot, which is kind of annoying. But you're also, you can save the game, which is super duper cool. But obviously it has to show you, like, an animation. It'd be cool if the game was actually playable, though. If you're wondering why I even bother having the generator running right now, it's because, um, so I can charge that. <laughs> So basically, the only thing I did was pump up all the tires. Also, let's toss the uh, this thing under here. It's kind of crazy how I haven't even played this game in so long that it, they added jack stands, which is absolutely awesome because I would have definitely wanted. I definitely wanted this. Oh, obviously, we're gonna be taking the um, half broken car to get gas. Um, we have to make sure to shut that off too. We're gonna take that with us and hope it doesn't die. Maybe as well as some uh, maple syrup and some poutine. I will just put that in the back with the gas can. It's perfectly fine. Um, also, we'll leave our fridge door open. <laughs> I'm surprised the game doesn't punish you for that, honestly, because they punish you for everything. Close all the doors. There's been so many awesome things that's happened. Like the old truck. You can actually customize it now, which is in incredibly awesome. All right, let's hop in. All right, how much gas does this thing got? Oh, it's got barely any. Okay, well, let's just throw it and drive, release the brake, and go as fast as we possibly can. Because that's probably safe, considering the fact, um, yeah, probably not smart. It's kind of a shame the manual transmission is so much slower than the manual because pretty much the whole point is they're trying to make you switch to the manual because they say manual is better in this game or whatever. But I don't know. I think it may be in real life, but I think it's kind of annoying having to shift in a video game without a wheel because I don't have a wheel. So I'm, I actually did have one, but it like fell off my table. Oh no, turn, turn, turn. And it shattered, so, I mean, not shattered, but, like, it fell into, like, 500 pieces, which wasn't good. Um, turn, 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 turn. The turns are so annoying, though. Also, here's something cool. Menu change. I mean, obviously, you saw that already, but, um, there's literally a... Somewhere in here. Ah, here, yeah, there's a cheats button. Which is cool. So you can finally actually save the game without going like a thousand, like going insane, you know? But because you have to turn on that computer while wait for it to play video game. Oh, did I forget to? I totally forgot to turn off the generator before I left. Oh well, I hope it doesn't use gas while it's unloaded. It probably does. But anyway, that's why we brought the gas can with us. We basically need to get the tire inflator and a bunch of gas. And we're gonna be out of money. Oh, goodness gracious. Hey, maybe we don't need the tire inflator. Uh, we can just grab some paint or something to have some fun. I know it'd be probably smart to actually grab what we need, but you know, whatever. Um, how'd you get over here? What does grid mode do? Whoa. I don't know what that is. I don't like it. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna have to grab this. Are you kidding me? You should be able to get out of this. Uh, maybe if the tires weren't inflated. I mean, were inflated, this would be good. So we're just gonna pull it back up the hill and it's probably gonna fall right back in as soon as we let it go. But we'll see, all right. Bob. Let's get in and see if it works. I pressed E instead of um. It's released. All right, we gotta pull it some more. This is already a disaster. 
And we're like five seconds in. That's why we really need to inflate our tires. Okay, so we are gonna get the tire inflator. I'm surprised that things didn't just fly everywhere immediately yet. Get in. Oh, there we go. <sighs> that's why that's why you really need to inflate your tires. Also, I should have brought that coffee, but whatever. They're like three dollars at that um, gas station, so whatever. Alright, we're almost there. Is the render distance lower than it usually is? I think the render distance is way lower than usual for some reason. Maybe it's a feature. Um, video. Um, yeah, it's- oh no, that's the field of view. Mm, ultra... Apply. There we go. Perfect, now we're on ultra settings. And still getting a solid 60 FPS. Um, I don't know why I didn't default to that, but whatever. I'll, I almost see it. Um, nope. Not there. Here. Yeah, the car is like so much slower with the tr with the um, automatic than the manual in this game. Uh, I don't know if it's like that in real life. It, I don't think it is though. All right, let's get inside. Let's grab a tire pump so that doesn't happen again. What we just went through. Um, that way. Oh yeah, they also say um, things in French now when you buy stuff from them, which is cool. We're gonna pump all the way up as far as we need to. We're basically just gonna do it until it looks like a circle. That looks like a circle, so good. How much did I put it on? Uh, like 35. Okay, so we'll do 35 on all of them. Oh, I don't know what that was doing. Alright, there we go. We're just gonna put 35 on all of them, about, maybe. Ah. Alright, oh, that was above. Whatever. I'm sure it's fine. That was probably the one that got us stuck this time. Because it's pretty much, like, in the ground. They should fix that, by the way, to make it so that it doesn't show that the tire is stuck in the ground ever when it deflates itself. I don't know what that was. Oh, I mean, it was a car, obviously. But, I mean, it would be cool if all, like, cars, like, randomly went into the gas station or whatever, and it would be funny if you had to, like, wait for them to to fill up, um, for, and so, so, so you couldn't. I don't want to put too much in here, you know, because, um, I barely have any, uh, oh, wait, is there actually, oh, nope, there's nothing in here, because I don't actually have that much money, so I don't want to waste it all for in this, because we need to, obviously, we need to put some in our car as well. Also, how come this guy is too expensive to use the regular gas? Like, I'll show you what happens if you press on it. It says you can't use this peasant fuel, but like, so we have to spend super fuel on our generator. It's kind of stupid. I know it's a game, but still. And besides, the gas is probably like less expensive than it is in real life, so. Um, the regular is probably, the super is probably just as expensive as it is in real life. Like, you see how cheap it is compared to like real life prices? Oh yeah, let's pull in sideways. I hope I put the gas cap on the right side. This is like real life car troubles. Should we just spend like all of our money on gas? I mean, we'll leave like $10 left maybe. Because like this car is like really low on gas. Sure, we'll leave. We'll leave that much. I was so close to getting $20 left, but we had to leave some cents. Um, not on purpose. Um, Alright, so we got like half now. So now we can head all the way back. Also, it seems that since I've started playing this game, I've got a headache. Well, how come every time I start recording, I get a headache? Weird. Well, not every time. But sometimes, whenever I start recording, I get a headache. Maybe it's the combination of talking and playing video games, who knows? Um, we're almost back, anyway. Like, it seems like the RPMs are so weird with the automatic. I just, I don't know. Let's just go as fast as we possibly can. Which is definitely probably a mistake. Also, it seems like the car turns way better with a wheel. You know? Um, yeah. Because I have played it with a wheel before, but never on video because it's just, like, more tedious. 
I got it from like uh, I got it from Cash Converters for five bucks. It was pretty good. I played Beam and G with it like for like one day, and then I dropped it the next day, which was super annoying. Because I'm not gonna get another one for five dollars. But it was fun while it lasted. Maybe I'll pick up another one and maybe some pedals too. That would be awesome. I could have like the full gas brake clutch and steering wheel set up for Mon Moogle. That's kind of overkill. Who like, do you guys actually play Roblox still? Cause I, I played Roblox a lot, but I have not played it in like a year. I don't even think I have it installed anymore. I like how we're playing a car game and we're talking about uh, Roblox now. Well, I am anyway. But I used to really like the game of uh, Roblox, but just the games got so boring and repetitive, you know? So I just play everything other than Roblox now. All right, we're almost back though. All right, we're back now. That was a lot quicker than I remember it being. Also, in case you haven't noticed, we got a um. Goodness gracious! Oh my god! Uh, did I dots? I wonder if you forget to turn off the car. Does it like run? Sl I mean run out faster ah oh, dang it anyway let's fill this up with a little bit are you kidding me well that was stupid uh, anyway we'll just fill it up a little bit we don't need much um only s yeah that was like i'm pretty sure this takes like four of these just to fill it up one let's see um how much gas is in this because I want to use this. I think I figured out how to start it. Um, oh, there's some. I think I figured out how to start it. Let's see. Alright, so. If that one of those lights. Wait one second. Controls. Keybinds. Um, what's shift up and shift down? Shift up, 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 up. Oh, here it is. Um, shift up is E, and shift down is Q. Okay, so it is E and Q. Yeah, I can't find. Oh, there it is. Okay. Now in theory, no. Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay, I figured it out. Why is it going so slow? Why in the world? Oh, wait, is the parking brake on? It was on. Let's see how fast this thing goes. Um, it's going pretty fast. Considering the fact you can shift. Oh, I think we're on the last gear. Okay. It's pretty fast though. Oh. Ah, oh, dang it. Um, it's fine. Let's just downshift, shift up again. On something this tiny, you downshift and then you immediately need to shift up again. Wait, we should go visit this guy because if you have to become very good friends with him or whatever. I actually didn't do that. Oh. Because I never actually did that. Well, this is the guy you sell firewood to. So you gotta be friends with him first. Oh, whoa. The staircase is broken. Uh, anyway. Yeah, they actually say things now. Yeah, they say things when you when you talk to them. Like the thing they're saying in the game, they say in French. Because if you didn't know, this is supposed to be Canada in 2005. So yeah, that's why there's no phones or any. Actually, how come there's a game console if this is 2005? And that's a good question, actually. Because there's that little red look switch thing. Yeah, I can open it up. I should not do that. Well, okay. Wait, can I can I can control it? End the game at the same time. Okay, that's awesome. Um, anyway. Let's drive back. We'll actually be able to use this now, which is nice, because I figured out how to start it. Let's just park this here. And shut it off. 
Alright, guys, I hope you enjoyed this simple little episode, and with that, I will see you all later. Bye!